Welcome back everybody, I'm Michael Foley and in this video I'm going to show you how to do a pendulum sweep for Brazilian Jiu Jitsu. I got my longtime student and good friend Muhammad here with me and he's a purple belt. He's got 80, 90, 100 Jiu Jitsu <laughs> matches under his belt. He's been away a few years living in England and training over there while he's working. But we got him home for a little while here so we're going to work through some moves together today. So like the other sweeps in our closed guard sweeps playlist, I'll put the link in the description below. This one is best set up from closed guard, but the beauty of this one is, is I don't need a lot of movement from Muhammad to start this. I can actually jump start this one myself. It looks like this. From closed guard, the first thing I want is a grip on his wrist. A good practice when you're first starting out with Brazilian Jiu Jitsu is to get used to starting your closed guard with a pocket grip or a pistol grip. You can also do a mid sleeve grip here like this or behind the elbow, but any one of these controlling grips, I love the pocket grip, so that's typically the one I go with. And then this hand here is gonna grab the collar on the same side. You can jump start most of your sweeps from here. The one we're doing today is the pendulum sweep. So I just want this, but this hand here is gonna do something different. I'm gonna dive through Mo's knees and I'm gonna grab the inside of his leg. Once I got that, I'm gonna kick this leg up like I'm trying to get it to touch the floor over my shoulder. And then as I do that, I bump my hip out to the side. This creates an angle, opens my hip a little bit. So the inside of my right leg is gonna hit underneath Mo's arm and that's gonna off balance him and tip him over. So it looks like this. Once I get here, I wanna kick this leg back and I'm gonna roll up with Mo and get the sweep. Another angle, I get my pocket grip I dive through his base right here. I turn my palm up and I'm gonna cut the back of his leg right here with my hand. Then I'm gonna kick open my outside leg first, create an angle with my hip, and then I hit him on the base of his arm right here with the inside of my leg. That off balances him. Then I tip him over, I pull up on this leg, kick my leg back, and roll up the mount. Here's where most people get stuck. So they set it up right, they get their pocket grip, they get underneath the leg. When they go for their sweep, they off balance, but they keep their knee bent right here. Nine times out of 10, when I see a white belt do this, they try to continue to mount anyways. And then the person on bottom is just gonna post their hands on your hips and shrimp out. Boom, and if they understand the game, you're in a perfect position to get leg locked. Here's what I'm gonna do instead. Set it up, dive underneath, but when I kick over with this foot here, after I create the angle and I kick up with my right leg, this leg swings back hard and fast and I keep my leg straight. So it looks like this. And I come up over my hip and not my knee. Without a partner, here's the movement with my hips. From right here, I open up with this leg and then I kick this back as I swing this one over. I get this leg behind me so I can roll over my hip and come up from there. So here's a little bonus move you can do off of this. If your opponent tries to base out with this hand and you're going for the pendulum sweep, you have the opportunity to hit him with an arm bar. So I'm gonna use my pocket grip here again, but I keep my elbow in nice and tight to my body. I get this under hook, I go for my sweep, but they try to base out really hard. Now from here, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna bring my elbow back to my center line, swing this leg over their head, clamp down, and it's a free arm bar. Thanks again for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and turn on notifications. I'm Michael Foley. I'll see you on the mats.